Okay, man. Yeah, this is your boy, the Forex Strategy Factory. You know, one thing I want to tell you right here is um, about how to analyze the market, you know, how you're going to analyze the market and how you're going to analyze it properly. That is exactly what I'm always showing you. That's what my video is always all about. Now, the first thing we're going to do, you know, if I'm going to use the NZD JPY, for example, please don't take my video as if I'm analyzing NZD JPY. No, I'm just trying to teach you how to how to do technical analysis. You understand? So in case you are watching this in the future, please always take note of the date that this video was made. OK, now, if I'm going to analyze this type of market, I take a look at where it has made the biggest moves. Okay? This is the biggest move it has made. Now, based on the Bollinger Band strategy, you can always see that when the price has made the biggest move and hit the outside band of the Bollinger Band, it's always going to go back. Then it's been going back from here. The rule of Bollinger Band holds right here. Then... We, we we started going down the nj started going down all the way from here okay and then you know going down all the way from here you understand me this is what it is you know going down all the way from here maybe that's what we got for now okay that's what we got for now okay and each of the move is starting on a pivot, on a pivot level. Okay, now let me now take a look at this is a pivot right here. Okay, which means a new move started from here. Always try to analyze your market this way. Started from here. This is a pivot. A new move started from here. Okay, I don't like to make color color on 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 a kind of trend lines, but you know, let me take take you to the point where I feel like mm -hmm, a new move started from here. This pivot here. Okay, now where is it going? After you have analyzed all these things, that okay, this is going down, man. So where is it going to end? See, I told you, the Bollinger Band when it makes the big moves there's every tendency going back to where the move got started now this is where the move got started where it escaped the middle band of bb in my case i use the bb20 i use the bb bollinger band 20 is what i use let's make it this color here okay the price is coming here it's coming back here that is why it's making these moves but then where am i gonna get out okay this is very important to know your exit look this is where my own tps are i'm gonna get out you know some few levels before it get to the you know to where it it tear the middle band of the bb okay so i am getting out from this level look bro and sisters this is how to analyze your market. I don't need too much indicators. You don't need any kind of things to make your chart look so fancy. Look at how I gave you now. Very simple analysis. Just looking at the chart. Well, maybe it's based on experience. Look at this thing. A triangle formed. Broken the broken the lower, lower part of the triangle. Okay. Now, it's coming here okay so this is gonna be just a short video about how you can analyze the market just by looking at it now if i said okay from this triangle it is going down right what do you need you see you need something that is going to show you that it is time to enter for a sell if you have analyzed a market that looks like this then that you have detected that it is actually going down then you need something that will tell you it is going down this is where you need your 